all the time my parents but when I was like vaping in college <laughs> Guys, I don't know what I was saying. I meant to say click subscribe button down below. Down below. Please don't forget to follow me on my social media, which is always linked down in the description box down below, or it's always somewhere on the screen. Today we will be doing a less hustling video, hence why I'm all glammed up. Well, as the title down below says, you know what we'll be doing. We'll be doing assumptions about me. So, <laughs> I got a few. Not a lot, but just a few. And it's crazy what people think about little old me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Because you want to be a part of the family, of course. Just welcome, welcome, welcome all, welcome all. <laughs> Without further ado. Let's just hop into this video. First assumption is you're done for the year. Once the person sent me this message, I didn't quite understand what it means by you're done for the year. So I was thinking that the person meant with track and feel and woo woo. With track and feel, I can never be done. It's always a sport that keeps on going, going, going. Unless I'm finished with school. Check, I, I ain't done with track and field. Second assumption is, did pierce your ear again? But from Thanksgiving, I haven't pierced my ear. I did the monkey bar, the industrial. I keep on calling it monkey bar. People ask me why I call it monkey bar, but I think that's what they call it in my country. Comment down below if you guys have an industrial pierce uh, an industrial piercing as well because <laughs> i like it i'm not gonna get any more piercing until this one heals up and i have this one since thanksgiving and it hasn't healed as yet because people keep on hurting my like keep on touching me giving me hugs and kisses because i'm just a sweet girl <laughs> boy if you don't get they keep on hurting my ear and I just gotta stop taking hugs from people. Just gotta tell them back up. Just to get my ears healed. But until my hair is healed, I will not be getting any more pierce. Ultimate light skin. <laughs> uh, I wish. That's crazy! No, I'm joking. I'm proud of my black or chocolate complexion. And I'm not an ultimate light skin, but I'm an ultimate chocolate skin. Skin, baby girl baby boy <laughs> best wife ever but <laughs> well I can say I can say I agree with you I, I am the best wife ever the best wife ever you curse a lot I, I don't like cursing. I try to take cursing out of my daily daily life. I don't curse unless I'm really, 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 really upset. Because I don't want to take cursing into my future or I don't want to be cursing around my kids. So I try not to curse. If I'm mad, oh my gosh, I just don't speak. I just can't let nobody steal my joy you are a player no I'm not really I don't I don't I don't like cheating I don't I, I, I am not a player there are times in life when um, I've made mistakes but I I am not a player you love to have The person that wrote is I'm praying for you. That's all I gotta say. But love to have I think is overrated, really. You wear the pants in your relationship. Well 
when I see stuff and I don't like stuff, I make it known that I don't like it. I don't necessarily say that I wear the pants, but I'm a talk up. I'm not gonna let any boy have any last say over me unless I know I'm wrong. When I'm right, I'm right, and when I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But I do not wear the pants in the relationship. I just speak up. This person said, you don't like to go nowhere. I never see you at college parties. Well, coming from a GPA that I was before, and I'm currently at a GPA that I'm very pleased with, college parties are just not in my daily plan, my schedule. I, I might go to one and two, yes, but I can't be partying all night when I know that the main focus is college and getting my degree and trying to get a good GPA and maintain a good GPA. If I go to college parties like back to back to back and trust me they have a lot but if you party too much you're just gonna be tired of it so I just don't college parties are just not for me again not for me you a chef <laughs> it's funny because I always be posting the food that I cook it look good it tastes good but I ain't a chef I'm not a chef really I'm, not. I'm just learning um, I'm a learning phase in my life, so I'm learning how to do stuff, learning how to cook stuff, apply stuff, my makeup, lit. I'm learning. So it's just a learning process. I am not a chef. You don't like keeping friends. Well, there are a lot of fake people in this world, and I just choose my friends wisely. Let me just say that. It's not the fact that I don't like keeping friends. I choose my friends wisely. When I got this one, I was so, I died laughing. This person said, you are spoiled. Oh my God. Suppose I was spoiled, guys. Look at my face. Suppose I was spoiled. I am not spoiled. My parents just make sure that they give me stuff that are necessary. They award me now and then, but they give me stuff that I don't want, but stuff that I need. They try to make me live a comfortable life so that I don't go out there and ha ask guys to, for stuff. And I would like to thank them. I would like to give them a round of applause for that. I love all my parents grew me and that's how I plan to grow my kids as well. You're a weed head. Mm, nope. Mm -mm. I tried weed once. And <laughs> I don't even smoke because I'm from Jamaica. People think that weed is my best friend. I tried weed once and I found that that, that was not for me. Smoking was not for me. Plus I have asthma. I'm asthmatic. And when I when I when I was like don't tell my parents, but when I was like vaping in college, I found out that it wasn't it just made my chest hurt. And I couldn't breathe, so I just stopped. You don't plan to go back to Jamaica. Oh my gosh, I miss home. I plan to go back to Jamaica when I have money. I don't plan to stay for now because I don't really have anywhere there to stay. My mom and my dad are in Canada, of course, and I don't really have any place to stay in Jamaica. So if I'm going there, it's gonna be for like two weeks or one week or for a vacation just to go back home and taste that delicious food enjoy the nice music the good parties the parties that I am used to I just can't wait to go back to Germany and this is the last and final assumption about me and this person said you are intelligent what is your secret <laughs> thank you that one is a compliment because if you knew me if I, when I was back in Jamaica, boy, mm -mm, you say this girl could not be this girl right now. I was dumb. Is mayonnaise an instrument? You know what? I wasn't even dumb because I was just following friends and I was really gone. I didn't know what to do with my life. So schoolwork was there, but it wasn't really there. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys liked this video. Give it a big thumbs up if you did. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Also remember to follow me on my social medias, which are always down in the description box down below or always on the screen. You know? Always on the screen. <laughs> Until next time guys. See ya. Bye. Uh -huh.